Hey guys, Jacob Moon with Jacob Moon from Oxen today. I know you see a black screen, don't worry about that. I'll fix that in a second. I want to thank you guys so much for 300 subs. It is amazing to me that I've gotten 300. And uh, more thoughts on that in the past uh, 300, in my 300 sub special video. But in that video, I mentioned the viewer requested model uh, contest. I've got my top five picks right now, and I am going to show you, and I want your help on letting me decide on which one of these I should build. So all these have been requested by people, and I will give them a shout out as we go on. Alright, so first choice, uh, again, info card will be up above, uh, over in this corner here. Okay, so first choice is... Courage Gallegos uh, vote, or what he suggested, was G1 Unicron. Been wanting to make him for a while, and, and this kind of gives me an excuse. <laughs> if you don't know, uh, he transforms into, not that, he transforms into this, a kind of a planet, basically. Here's the toy. Uh, load. Yeah, there's the toy version. Uh, compare that to the toys robot mode. So yeah, I'd be making Unicron. Uh, he wouldn't be massive. He would probably be a little small, micro or mini scale. But okay, so that's the first one. Second one, brick it up with synthetic Mason. Suggested Blitzwing, which uh, I kind of already made a Star Scream, which. Everybody thought was Blitz was Starscream, but no, it turned out that's Blitzwing. So, I guess somebody he suggests I make Blitzwing. Man, that image won't load. There's another one, and that one won't load either. <laughs> there we go. So yeah, he tra he's a triple changer. He transformed into a tank, a robot, and a jet. Oh, stupid pictures won't load. There you go. All right. That would be probably my normal scale. Then we have G1 Defensor, suggested by Madimus Productions. And this guy looks awesome. <laughs> I actually, my dad owned this toy here. This one, right there. Yeah, my dad owned that one. I'm going to have to bring that one in for scale. It, I might actually make it correct size, toy size. But it just depends. We'll find out whenever... I build it, but yeah, uh, I think I might. I think I might make him the correct toy size, at least to the toy I have. So yeah, um, let me know. He is option number three. And then we have Isaac the Zebra. Uh, Isaac the Zebra, I Lego mocks and set reviews. So he suggests Ironhide. Uh, don't worry about the ratchet. I just found this good photo. Uh, there's a nice Lego one. I might have to. <laughs> I like that one. Here's a. In case you did not know, that head was actually never included in the original toy, so it it never had a head. It looked like this without a head. And then aftermarket released uh the fake these little placement heads. But yeah. So, I would probably be going with the G1 look, make him transform into this van here, and then have him in robot mode. I would try my best not to use the little battle sled thing, because I hate that, but uh, we'll see how it turns out. And he would, again, be in my normal scale. Alright, and lastly, we have Metroplex, which is... A very big transformer. I love this picture with the toy and the Game Boy. It's adorable. Uh, mm. Let's see. Should have a better. Here is uh, an idea of what it transforms. He's a triple changer. Transforms into a uh, cruiser, a city, and then a robot. Mm. And that picture won't load. Uh, there we go. And a robot. So yeah, that is all of the choices. You have five choices. 
again, we'll go through them again. Unicron. Uh, Blitzwing. G1 Defensor. And yes, that would all combine. So all these. And they would most likely have their a little bot for each one. So each one would have a little bot mode and then the big combined mode. Alright, and then Ironhide. And lastly, Metroplex. So let me know in that info card right up there which one you want to see. And I will make it ASAP. This has been Jacob Moon with Jacob Moon's Mocks. Hope you enjoyed uh, this video. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.